What's up, YouTube? Welcome to another episode of Soda Shots. I'm James. You all remember Frankie? We have two new additions to our video this time. Jen, the camera girl, you might remember her. And Sean. We have Dog too, but you can't see Dog. Dog is, yeah, Dog is hiding. Dog is being uh, Dog. This is the Gross Gus's episode. We have uh, five sodas here from the Gross Gus company. They're all standard, well, I wouldn't say standard. I'd say non-standard flavors of soda, but they're all named hilarious things. So let's well, get I mean, started with, and we'll throw some pictures up afterwards to show everybody. Let's start with Bloody Nose. That sounds like my favorite one. The Bloody Nose is supposed to be a wild cherry soda, so we'll... That sounds actually good. All oh, right. On, let's sniff. It's the sniff. As test. standard, we do the sniff test. Dude, that's a nice, nice little... It's, you know, it, um... It smells like an icy. Um, yeah, the cherry, yeah, icy. The cherry icy. The cherry icy or one of the cherry uh, uh, otter pops. That's what I was thinking. Dude, about. yes. Oh, great. Now I want otter pops. Can we do an <laughs> episode on otter pops? Can we just freeze it? Oh, man. <laughs> All right. Bottom, down the hatch. Bottoms up. Mm. The smell was better to me yeah. than yeah. the taste. Well, the flavor kind of disappears after. It was well, just really quick. It was it actually really like, important. It tastes like big red to me. Yeah, Except like, not the big. It's not, it actually, very good carbonation. I would say like great yeah. carbonation. Well, great carbonation is fine, but it's well, lacking in, huh. in flavor. Oh, we didn't do a rating on the time. Oh well, who cares? Rating now, out of five. Out of five for the smell, I would give the smell 3.8. And then the taste. I would give the taste a three. Oh. Yeah, it wasn't anything special. Yeah, yeah. three. So I'll, I'll say four is off of the smell, but for flavor, a two point five because it's I, very lackluster. I'm pretty I'm pretty close to that. It's the four because it smelled good, but it was about a three, about average in my book. I had, I had higher expectations with the smell. I did. Yeah. Next up on our list is <laughs> dinosaur dung. Dinosaur. I know dung. we're all looking forward to dinosaur dung. This one is actually a chocolate soda, and if you've seen any of our episodes before, I love chocolate soda. Mm. Ooh, it smells like a Tootsie Roll. It does. I think, I think so far we're coming that Gross Gus, out of the two that we've smelled, that they're going to be classical sweets that we like. Ah, uh, yeah. Tootsie that roll. smells like a liquid Tootsie Roll right yeah, there. Yeah, it really does. We'll do it before this time, so sniff check now. Ooh. This one smells even nicer than the, than the Bloody Nose. I'd give that a 4 and a 4.5. 4. I'm gonna do the classical. 5! <laughs> no, I'm gonna give it a 5 too. It does, it does smell. I, I couldn't tell what you did there. I couldn't see it, but... Uh, it's the... No, no I, I, I can't see it. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Bottoms up. Mm. Whoa. Whatever sugar the cherry one was missing, it's in this one. Uh, really? Like, I, this one was definitely better, and it was, like, mm -hmm. I feel like the flavor was more consistent, but I still felt really underwhelmed by it. So, underwhelmed, what's your ranking? Mm, three and a half, 3.5. I'll give it a four. So what'd you give it? I'm gonna go with a three, because halfway, it, it, better than the cherry, but still needs improvement. I'm going to give it a five anyways. I just like chocolate soda, so... <laughs> well, then we won't count down the averages. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's my... I love chocolate soda. It did taste a little watered down, and it's not something you can drink just, you know, like a Mountain Dew or something like yeah. that, because you're going to get... Th it's making me thirsty drinking it, which is... Not only that, like... I, I'm going to know... I'm going to guess that the... One of the, one of the themes that's going to come up is we're going to enjoy the smells of all these uh -huh. more than the actual tastes. Uh -huh. Yeah. On that note... <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Next up on the list is... That's right, pirate piss. We're all excited about trying pirate. Butter. Well, we got piss and shit now, so there we go. We're all we're all in. Oh, I forgot to say what it was. It's actually banana flavored. Well, at the very least, I will say the smell is yep. accurate to what it is. The Mike and Ike's banana. Yep. 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 Put I those in a pot. Happy. Melt those down. Yep. <laughs> or the the little the little hard banana. It's things. not. It's not. What is it, Mike? Real... It's not Mike's and Ike's. Runts. 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 That's what they were, yeah. We yeah. Sniff check. Well, we all agree <laughs> it smells like banana. Can I give it I instead have... of a number? No. <laughs> banana at a time, But, uh... Would you say it's bananas? No, actually, I'm going to give this a two for the smell. Yeah. Three. 
average. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with three. Yeah, I'm gonna go with three. Hopefully, this is one of those ones that goes get... backwards, and we're like, man, this is the well, best one ever. Yeah, I'm hoping my expectations are uh, flipped <laughs> right now because otherwise, this is gonna suck. You will finally otherwise, be able to say you like just, pirate piss. We're just, <laughs> we're just gonna be whelmed. <laughs> that got me out of you. Yeah. Actually, why yes, that was a banana. <laughs> that really all is you can say about it. <laughs> yep, banana. Next. <laughs> That's, That's really all you can say. <laughs> yeah, it, taste, it doesn't taste like, okay, so, I mean, I think my score is going to go up. Um, but it does taste better than it smelled. Yeah. But, but it's literally... Just, just, just banana. banana. But it doesn't taste like only banana. It tastes like water and banana, which I guess isn't that bad in this context. Oh. Yeah, I mean, I'll give this one maybe a 2.5, <laughs> maybe a 3, but not anything higher than that. But it's tasting, it's like... Banana. I guess we got what we came for. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if pyre piss tastes like this, I'm drinking it all the time, so... I, I, mean, I would give it a 2. I was like... That was like, bananas. Uh, its its flavor was definitely not bananas, <laughs> except it was only bananas. <laughs> Soraka would definitely approve. Uh -huh. That's uh -huh. terrible. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I still have some of my cups. I gotta finish it real quick. Oh, what'd you yeah. give it? What'd you give it? So, off of the approval of the League of Legends character, I would say it's it's good. Five. It's good. I'm, yeah, I'm, good. after my little like, little extra bit taste there, two point five. 2.5. So you were unsure, then it went down. Yeah. <laughs> I, I don't no, know. No, yeah, that's bananas. Yeah. That is, uh, let's get that out of here so we don't have the next one. Okay, these last two, we only have two left. We're going to try and do a quicker episode. Uh, the last two are the most enticing, or most interesting, I would say. So the next... Oh, this, this one will be my favorite. Gross. Yeah, I know, I, I saw that and I almost backed out just with the sound of it. Actually, the last two are probably going to be my favorite. Yeah. This one is actually called Pimple Pop. Now, I don't think it's going <laughs> to... We got the best look from our camera guy over there. I don't think it's going to taste as bad as it sounds because it's actually marshmallow soda. So if it doesn't taste like sugar, then they did something wrong. I smell fruity pebbles. <laughs> really? I like almost smell nothing. It's like so faint. Yeah. I, I, I do say it's faint. There is a smell there. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. So the first... Her first reaction was fruity pebbles. Mine's Play-Doh. Oh. It smells like Play-Doh to me. No, that's not good. No, it's How not, did you no. have both of them from your last drinks, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so rankings? <laughs> um, if I'm going to go with the Play-Doh, I'm going to give it like a 1.5. If we're going with the fact that I like almost don't sense one, I want to rate it a does not exist. <laughs> <laughs> it is very faint. It is. Well, I smell fruity pebbles, so I'm going to give it a 4. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go with 1. Uh, for smell, it's like if you were just smelling the soda, you wouldn't really think, man, this is going to taste good. Well, I guess in a couple of moments, you're about to find out if it does taste good. Yeah. And for all those people who had Play-Doh out there, I'm giving it a four. <laughs> a tasty, salty Play-Doh. Gross. Yeah. <laughs> Only for right. that sort of thing. Down the hatch. Down the hatch. Huh. Yep. That was actually not bad at all. It does not taste like marshmallow. No, it, it does not. not. It, it doesn't taste bad. It doesn't taste bad, but it is no. as far away from marshmallow as it's dinosaur sugary. is from chocolate. It's sugary for it's sure. cream soda. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's kind of like cream soda. Yeah. I think, like, I know straight up, I think for this maybe, one. Maybe it would have been better instead of going for the soda that they, if they would have done, like, a cream soda process yeah. to this, it would have been better. If they added, like, it just needs a little more cream, it'd be just great, fantastic. You said the key word, though, that it's taste processed. Yeah. It tastes very artificial. I'm going to actually give this one a four. Four. Three. Three. Four. Four. Yeah, I'm going to give it a four. That one actually yeah. went backwards. It's, it's pretty good. Yeah, that one, I actually enjoyed that. The last one is Dragon Drool. <sighs> Dragon Drool does not smell, or does not sound like it would taste like black licorice. Oh, God. <laughs> black licorice time, guys. Yeah. Um, you all know. I love how he specifically poured less of this one. <laughs> it's faint too, though. It is. It's, it's faint, faint, but you definitely know it smells it's like... It's faint, but when you smell it, it's strong. It's weird. You know it smells like candy. You know, it, it honestly it's just... black it, licorice. Yeah, it smells like black licorice. Yeah, pretty and solid. And because up. of that, I'm going to give it a two. <laughs> Three. 
Well, I'm gonna give it a, a five for smell, going actually what it's supposed to. Yeah, yeah I was gonna say five for with. accuracy of the smell, two for the actual smell. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go with yeah, five for the smell and two for how excited I am to drink it. <laughs> Accurate. <laughs> so uh, without further ado, are you ready to uh, hate your life? Yep. Let's go. Right, time to hatch. Um, it's about as good as I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Um, you, you, it's. I like it better than the absence. <laughs> Jen really likes it. <laughs> the aftertaste is weird. Mm, yeah. um, she wants to try some. Okay, our camera guy. I keep saying our camera guy. Everybody remembers Parker. Come over here. He's been in our episodes. He actually likes black licorice, so he's gonna try it. Huh. I like that, that was the shrug of exception. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't quite taste like black licorice, though. Or I'm, dragon drool. I'm yeah. gonna, or that thing. I'm gonna rate it a no. <laughs> I think it's a four for me. Yeah. Well, if we're gonna go off of one of our other videos, <laughs> when somebody said no, no, <laughs> this one's getting an F. <laughs> F for nice, nice. fantastically <laughs> terrible. I mean, um, not terrible. Um, yeah, that's that's a one and a half for me. I think on that one though, it's less of the. Yeah. Say the worst. Yeah. Well, that was all of the grossest Gus line. We found that line at Rocket Fizz. Thank you, Rocket Fizz. I find it all my favorite sodas there, so... Rocket Fizz is glorious. Yes. If you guys don't have any of their sodas, uh, stores in your town or anything, you can definitely Google them. I do believe they deliver, or like... They, I, think they, I think they might ship it. I'll have to ask again when I go in there. Okay. We'll get back um, to you on another, or we'll write that in the description. There is also tons of candy there, too, that is off-shelf, or off They've off got topic. tons of stuff. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I'm expecting to go in there and find, like, fizzing Whizbees or something. For the one for us, they have, like, literally almost every flavor of taffy you can think of. Basically, oh, imagine yeah. Birdie Bots in a taffy formation. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah. All right, so that's the episode. Hope you liked it. Bye. 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 Peace! <laughs> awesome sign-off. <laughs>